last night. Alright, day two, it's snowing, yesterday it was not, the day before it was raining, what is this? So, up the same wind direction, and it's just cold. It's going to be interesting if we see anything. I doubt we will, but we got a little after five. Haven't seen anything yet. We're still hoping. My shooting time is coming kind of to a close quick. Shooting time is just about over. <coughs> Don't think we're going to get anything tonight. I'll say this one's done. Alright. Uh, this is day four. I don't have any footage for day three. Didn't see anything. Here. Yeah. I think there's something down in the valley. I don't know what. I think it's a deer. It's making a lot of noise. Well, there's some dude bag riding his four wheeler around in the woods. That don't help. I don't even know if he's on this property, but it probably is. Shouldn't be. Probably is. There's a deer down in the valley. It was doing the snort wheeze thing. Or the wheeze, one of the two. Sound like a steam engine. I just had a group <coughs> of toes that I've shot at before go in front of me. Except in front of me, they weren't out of range. Alright, I might have just shot one, I don't know, just snuck in after the rest, I heard something thunk, it wasn't the crossbow, but for all I know I could have just bounced shoulder, the last two times I've shot here I've bounced, or I've hit back, the time before that, I was at another spot and I just straight up shot over, so I'm about to go find out, I really hope I did. I really hope I did. And it don't look like I did. Nope. We hit. We hit, guys. We hit. Oh, can. We hit. The arrow's red. Alright, I'm gonna do call. I'm gonna pop real quick. I'm gonna come help me track this thing down. Alright, so I might have shot, might have got shot the deer. I'm not sure. Arrow smells uh, an awful lot deep, lot like deer. Which isn't a bad smell, so. But I heard something break when I hit. Crossbow went thunk. Something else went thunk. 
so I think I broke rib. Not sure, but I think I broke rib. At the very least. So, we hit, she's down somewhere in the woods behind me. She ran forever. But she did stumble once, so. Well, gotta go wait for my grandpa to come help me. Yeah, we didn't find the deer. And I might not be able to hunt this week just due to schedule and weather. Monday, busy. Tuesday, busy. Wednesday, Thursday, cold. Like single digits cold. Friday, busy. Saturday's my next day I'm open. Unless I manage to be able to hunt sometime before then. Which I really hope I can. Really hope I can. Because... That deer is marked. That deer is mine. It was a big doe. It's mine. I want that doe. I only got about a week left by the time I'll be able to hunt again to fill my uh, anywhere tag for a buck. Or a doe. And I'm probably going to cut it with the first deer that walks in the range. And then I got two others that got to the 15th of January. So I'm, I'm right. Alright. It's not next week. It's Wednesday. Um, we never found that deer, like I said. Uh, and considering the last group that I shot at, it didn't even hit him, I shot it. I take a hundred yard loop around this spot. Just to get to the other side of the hill. I want to probably go 200 yards at least. Uh, there's like three other deer in this area. That I haven't, two that I haven't shot at. Um, one's a buck, and I need that one. I got a little over a week to fill my tag for a buck. A little over, or about a month for the uh, two doe tags. And this is going to be my only outing of the week. Because uh, Thursday, Friday, Thursday, especially negative five, Friday, three degrees. Oh, it's sleeting, not snowing. Um, and what is it? And it's Christmas Eve and then Christmas and then it's hunting for five days, six days, uh, till I can fill that tag. Hopefully, hopefully I can fill that tag. My clothes are now freezing together. Yeah, it's, it's sleet. Or small hailstones, not snow. down out of the stand, getting slippery, that deer's still up on that hill, um, yeah, okay. put the camera away, alright, back at it, um, this is the first day of the last week of the season, it is the day or two days after Christmas. Um, there's been a lot moving in through here. From the tracks everywhere in the last couple of days. So let's see what happens. Getting closer to shooting time. I haven't seen nothing yet. Heard a bunch of squirrels and birds and whatnot, but that day be a good day. More or less, it's been in well over two weeks. That one doe is off to my side again, way out of range. If my grandma would have been here, I whacked her. 
Ladies and gentlemen, we just had a buck walk through here that I just absolutely nailed. I don't know where I hit him, but it wasn't where I hit him last time, so... I might have hit, might have shot low though, I'm, I'm not sure, but I whacked it. And then there's one up on the ridge, there was those four. Let's see, there's one, two, three, four. There might have been, there was five or six deer around here, and they all walked out within five minutes of each other. Five minutes. That buck was 20 yards from me when I took the shot. Well, I'm going to go down and see if I can't find the arrow real quick. Then I'll make my decision from there. Alright guys, here is my uh, seven point buck that I shot last night. Uh, you can count four points there. He would have been an eight, but uh, on this horn that we accidentally broke off, uh, his uh, brow time was broken. So, he's a seven point buck. Um, yeah. First buck. I still got two more tags left to fill, but I got, I don't have, I have until uh, January 15th instead of December 31st. So, I got some time to fill those. I'll show you the mount once I get, I'm going to mount just the horns on one of those kits. And I'll show you that one.